Hi! I am on Dartmoor, not Dartmoor. I'm at a place called Yelverton, which is very on the edge of Dartmoor, but I'm not sure if this bit counts. Anyway, we're going to Grenfell Woods and we're going for a swim and a picnic and we're gonna ride there. So I'm looking forward to taking you along. So we're starting off on this open moorland area, which is really lovely. just done this really fun muddy swoopy section which was a lot wetter than I thought it would be so we're on Harrow Beer and we're heading up the road in between the moors and then we're going to drop across down to Grenfell Woods so I'm just taking the road up because I think the climb's going to be super super muddy today well that lasted all of two seconds because I saw some mountain bike tracks going off the side and I thought no nah, it's too fun you don't ride a mountain bike to ride on the road so this route I'm doing in 2017 according to my Strava I did it loads and then today I'm riding it thinking where am I going? <laughs> I think I've seen where we're meant to go down. I hope it's right anyway. gonna head away from this beautiful place these amazing views and aim to quite a gnarly descent I think So I did pick the right descent and the reason I'm so worried about it at the moment is because I'm out of my hardtail and I've put gravel tyres on it because I'd like to do some more bikepacking trips and I don't really ride so much trail when I bikepack it's more distance but this place is amazing let me show you this bridge how cool is this up there is the cycle path on the actual bridge and it's just lush down here so I'm going to crack on. There's a little bit more single track, which I think we're going up that side. And then we hit a big steep climb. So I need to get a cracking up there. I'm doing the climb and it has a, a bluff in it, which I forgot about. <laughs> but we, to go down, you've got to go up, haven't you? And it's worth it. it
back on the open water now. Done the horrible climb. It's just so muddy and rooty. It's not even that steep. So now I'm keeping an eye out for the single track, which is super, super fun. And it takes us right the way down to double waters, which is the swim spot and picnic spot. And this place is just so, so beautiful. The sun is always shining on here. It's amazing. I'm gonna get ready to swim. I swam yesterday in the sea and it's about, I think nine degrees at the moment, constantly. And it was pretty cold and the river's gonna be even colder, but just don't stay in for too long, isn't it? It'll still be nice. So uh, I'm gonna, gonna get ready. see it on camera but the light is absolutely incredible right let's get back in oh it's so nice it sounds weird because obviously it's so cold but there's nothing like being in it there's just nothing else like it. Oh my goodness, this place is so incredible. I've just seen a kingfisher go across that way. And then there's a buzzard just flying up there, calling. Oh my goodness, every time I come here, it's so, so incredibly peaceful and beautiful. It's just such a beautiful place and it's an incredible swim. So I'm now going to get dried, get some clothes on so that I can have my picnic that I've brought with me. for a little while just eating my lunch and watching the birds there's so many different birds here there was a yellow one that had that sort of wagtail motion but i don't think you can get wagtails in yellow so i've no idea what type of bird that was and then there's two birds that keep flying up and down and i think they're doing a bit of a, a courting dance 
but I haven't been able to catch them on the camera. been here for quite a while now so I think I'm gonna pack up the bike and get ready to head back. We've still got such a nice way to go back because we go back along the river and then once we go back along the river we jump back onto the cycle path for the, the quick way back because there isn't really any sort of good single track going that way because we've already come down to come across so it's kind of uphill all the way back but it's still really really pretty. So I'm heading now down the track towards the bridge by Double Waters. I'm just going to stay on the main track today because I took so long. I didn't realise, you know when it's so peaceful and you're just so relaxed and then you look at the time and you think, whoa, <laughs> time's flown. I just had no idea. gonna go up through there. We're on the last bit of single track now and then we head up onto the main cycle path. We're on the final part now of the cycle path back to Yelverton. So I'm going to sign out. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Bye.